Welcome to Content, Business and Investments in Latvia, run by www.latvieland.com. In today's sharing, I would like to introduce the following information. Statelessness Act in Latvia. Article 1. The purpose of this law is to determine the legal status of stateless persons in the Republic of Latvia, as well as the rights and obligations of these persons. Article 2. 1. A person may be recognized as a stateless person in the Republic of Latvia unless a state has recognized the person as a citizen in accordance with its laws. 2. A person who has lost the status of a non-citizen of Latvia shall be recognized as a stateless person if this person does not have the citizenship of any other state, as well as does not have a guarantee for admission to citizenship issued in accordance with the procedures specified in foreign legislation. Article 3. 1. A person may not be recognized as a stateless person in the Republic of Latvia if the provisions of the Convention on the Status of Stateless Persons of 28 September 1954 do not apply to this person. 2. A person who is the subject of the law, on the status of citizens of the former USSR who do not have the citizenship of Latvia or another state, may not be recognized as a stateless person. Article 4. 1. In order to be recognized as a stateless person, a person shall submit to the Office of Citizenship and Migration Affairs. Here and after, the office. 1. An application. 2. An identity document. 3. A document issued by a competent foreign institution specified by the board, which certifies that the person is not a citizen of the relevant state, and is not guaranteed the citizenship of that state, or a documentary confirmation that such a document cannot be obtained. 2. If a person for reasons beyond his or her control is unable to submit any of the documents referred to in paragraph 1, clause 2 or 3 of this section, the authorized official of the office shall make a decision to recognize or refuse to recognize the person as stateless. Article 5. 1. A decision to recognize or refuse to recognize a person as a stateless person shall be made by an official authorized by the head of the office within three months after the submission of the document specified in Section 4 of this law. If necessary, an authorized official of the head of the office shall request that the person submit additional documents or information. 2. An official authorized by the head of the office may, for a justified reason, extend the term for making the decision referred to in paragraph 1 of this section for a period of up to one month. 3. A person has the right to contest the decision referred to in paragraph 2 of this section by submitting a relevant submission to the head of the office. 4. A person has the right to appeal a decision of the head of the board in court. Section 6. 1. A stateless person shall reside in the Republic of Latvia in accordance with the procedures specified in the immigration law. 2. A stateless person has the right to receive a stateless person's travel document in accordance with the procedures specified in the Identity Documents Law. 3. Excluded by the law of 15 February 2007. As amended by the law of 15 February 2007. Which enters into force on 15 March 2007. Section 7. 1. While residing in the Republic of Latvia. A stateless person is required to comply with the requirements of regulatory enactments of the Republic of Latvia. 2. A stateless person who legally resides in the Republic of Latvia has the right specified in the Convention on the Status of Stateless Persons of 28 September 1954, as amended by the law of 15 February 2007, which enters into force on 15 March 2007. Section 8. 1. A person loses the status of a stateless person in the Republic of Latvia if he or she has acquired the citizenship of Latvia or another state. 2. A person shall be deprived of the status of a stateless person if he or she has provided false information about himself or herself and thus unreasonably acquired the status of a stateless person in accordance with the provisions of this law and the Convention on the Status of stateless persons of 28 September 1954. 3. An authorized official of the head of the office shall take a decision regarding the deprivation of the status of a stateless person within one month from the day when the circumstances referred to 
in paragraph 2 of this section have become known. 4. An authorized official of the head of the board may, for a justified reason, extend the term for making the decision referred to, in paragraph 3 of this section for a period of up to one month. 5. A person has the right to contest a decision regarding deprivation of the status of a stateless person by submitting a relevant submission to the head of the office. 6. A person has the right to appeal a decision of the head of the board regarding deprivation of the status of a stateless person in court. Transitional provisions. 1. With the entry into force of this law. The law on the status of a stateless person in the Republic of Latvia, reporter of the Sejma and the Cabinet of Ministers of the Republic of Latvia, 1999, number 6. Shall become invalid. 2. Persons who have received a stateless person's identity document in the Republic of Latvia before the entry into force of this law by issuing a new stateless person's travel document shall at the same time be issued a permanent residence permit in the Republic of Latvia. 3. Applications regarding the determination of the status of a stateless person which have been submitted to the Department of Citizenship and Immigration and on which a decision has not been made by the date of entry into force of this law shall be examined and a relevant decision shall be made in accordance with this law. The law was adopted by the Sejma on January 29, 2004. With the information I have shared with you above, I hope this share is helpful for you in life and business. To see my next videos, please click on the subscribe button below and please share this video with acquaintances if you find it useful to them. If you are planning to invest or do business in Latvia, please contact us via website, www.latviland.com or email latviland247 at gmail.com. Good luck. See you in our next videos.